Hey guys, I got some packages in today, so um, I know exactly what's in all of these, and they're all kind of a theme, so I figured I would unbox the things that are inside them, and it's all Monstax merchandise, because you know, what else do I buy anymore? So, I, um, I joined some group orders, and they were all run by the same person, so all these boxes are from the same person. But, um, yeah, these are, there's three different group orders here. Ugh. So, okay, it's fine. Um, there's Japanese stuff. Oh my, oh, she sent me chocolate. What? Oh my god, this girl is great. Oh my gosh, I don't, I've never tried this kind. Spicy caramel, I don't, I don't know what that could be like, but I'm gonna find out. Let's see, a note. Okay. And some of these rubies. So there's um, goods from their Osaka showcase in Japan. There's goods from their pop-up store. And there should also be some postcard sets. So, uh, how do we get into this? I don't wanna cut the towel. <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Oh gosh, okay. And now this side. See, I'm, I don't remember if I've said this yet or not. Ah, just poked myself with it. Um, but I will link, I ordered through Facebook, so I will link the Facebook group and I'll put her name in the description also because she is absolutely wonderful. So I do think her group orders are US only. But still, she is fantastic. So if you live in the U.S., yay! And you want to join some group orders, I highly recommend going through her. So I got postcards. There's a third one in there somewhere, but um, these were sold on their official shop. And I'll talk about them more when I open them up. But I got one of each version. There's the third one. I'm really excited for those, so I'm going to leave those for last because I'm most excited for those. And I also got... She wrapped this so well. Oh my god. This girl is amazing. Oh my gosh. Okay, I also got the light stick from their Osaka showcase. And I will show you guys what this looks like in the dark after I like unbox it properly. And then I got the last thing that should be in this box. I got the official slogan from the Osaka showcase also. Then these are posters from the pop-up store. I will show them all later because it's always a struggle to get posters out of a poster tube for me, so. Then this is the last thing. This is, I did not do that well at all. Oh my God. I am not graceful when I open packages. Like some people, they just make it look really nice. No, I just rip it to shreds. Okay, I got the towel from their pop-up store. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with the posters to get those done because posters are always a struggle for me, a uh, struggle for me. And I 
I'm gonna have a lot less desire to take them all out and put them back at the end of this. So, we'll start with the posters and then I will show you guys this towel and then I'll show you the showcase stuff and then the postcard sets. So, be back soon with the posters. Okay, here is four of them. They're really big, so I'm gonna do them in two sets. Um, these were actually all sold individually at the pop-up store, so I had to buy all seven of them, of them individually, but that's okay. So, Kihan, Wanho. As you can see, they're quite large, because there's Hero, which is a jewel case size, so these posters are giant. Chinu, and try to get rid of the glare. Let's see, young one. So, there's the first four. They're actually in really good condition considering the way that the um, person in Japan shipped them. The way they shipped them was they didn't put them in a tube. They just put them all in a box and they were like stacked up on top of each other and some of them got a little squished. But they're actually looking really good, so I can't complain too much. I just hope the next time they buy posters and ship them halfway across the world, they put them in a tube. But... You can't have it all. So, yeah, I'll show the other three now. And these are the last three. So, again, with the glare, there's Juhan and Hip, and of course I am. So, these are the exact same images that their hero photo cards are. And they also use these pictures, like these exact same set of seven pictures, for a bunch of the other merchandise that they sold at the pop up store. So I kind of hope next time they put out a Japanese symbol, they use different pictures instead of just the same ones over and over again. I mean, I absolutely love these pictures, but I also love variety, but I cannot complain when I have these gorgeous, gorgeous posters in my life. So those were the posters, and now I'll show the towel, and then the Osaka, Osaka stuff, and then the postcards. All right, here is the towel. So I bought this one because I wasn't sure if it was like a slogan towel or if it was like a legit full-size towel. And it looks a lot bigger than a slogan towel. Okay, so, I mean, it's kind of like a giant slogan towel, I guess. This is gonna be hard to get in the frame. Yeah, that's not even close. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to stand up and do this. So, here is what the towel looks like. The back is just like this, so there's nothing on the back. So I will, ah, uh, what should I compare the size to? Uh, where did I put my hero symbols? Ah, uh, okay. So, there's hero, so as you can see, it's pretty big. Okay, so that is that towel. And then I will get the other towel out. So, once again, pausing. Alright, and then the showcase towel. I've noticed Japanese towels, they just put them in plastic bags, but Korean ones, they actually have like a legitimate like case for them. I kind of wish that the Japanese ones did too because it would make it a lot easier to store. And also, I like the little cases, so. I love how all the Japanese stuff has been purple so far, because their first showcase was purple, too. Okay, this is way more like an actual slogan towel. It doesn't want to lay flat, though. Stand up again. 
Okay. There's this one. This thing is so soft, by the way. I really like it. And then the back of this one is like the other towel where it's just like that. I do have their first Japanese one on the way also, but I won't be getting that for a while. But oh, this thing is so soft, oh my god. I might take this to their concert. Oh, it's so soft. Okay, onto the light stick. All right, oh shit, whoa. Okay, hold up. I am not put together, oh my gosh. Okay, let's try that again. This is light stick. And let me open it. This is like the longest flap ever, oh my god. Get out, oh, okay. Oh god, it's stuck, ugh. There we go. And, yeah, it's okay. This thing is really bent. And I don't know, I don't know what that says. I don't really care. So, that was probably how to turn it on. Ooh, so you just twist it. Does it have one setting? I think it only has one setting. Wait, you can turn. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know, Japanese guys. It looks like a pen. But it has. Why do I always hold things upside down? I like how sparkly it is, though. All right, I'm gonna go show you guys what it looks like in the dark, so. Okay, this is the light stick in the dark. I've noticed my camera does not do very well in the dark, so this looks a lot more purple in real life. It just looks white on camera, but it's, it's pretty. It's not the official light stick, but hey. I like it. So now, <coughs> sorry, uh, now moving on to the postcard sets, which is the last thing. So, yay. Okay, before I show you guys the postcard sets, I do, I just want to compare this in size to their um, light stick from X Clan Origins. So here's that one. And then here's this one. This one is so small. It's really adorable. So, I don't know. I just thought it'd be interesting to see the size difference. It's really cute. Oh, I like it. Okay, on to the postcards. So, there is, let me get this right. There's the beautiful set, the beside set, and the brilliant set. So I'm gonna go in order and so I have a theory about why these postcards exist, and my theory is that if you compare the, why is that upside down? If you compare the amount of photos in Beautiful to the amount of photos in literally every other album they put out, Beautiful has like very few. So I think Starship just had all these leftover pictures that they didn't know what to do with, so they were like, let's just make some postcard sets. And so they did, because they knew that we would buy them. And here I am, having bought them. So I'm gonna bring this down and zoom in if it will let me. Oh gosh. Okay, well, okay, that, yeah, that'll do. Oh my gosh, that's like the blurriest it's ever been. Okay, there we go. So, I believe these are the same size as the postcards in Beautiful, so I'm gonna compare real quick, because why not? So, oh, sh why do I keep hitting this? Oh my god. 
this is from the beside version and they are like a perfect match so yeah you could totally store these in your album if you wanted to i wouldn't but to each their own so i'm really excited i haven't looked at these at all I'm gonna bring my tripod down because it just seems so far away. Okay. So I think the bag's the same on all of them. But I'm gonna check real quick because if it is, I'm just gonna look at the front for the rest of these. Yeah, the back's the same. So. Oh man, okay. Uh, gosh. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this down. <laughs> oh. oh, that's really cool. What the hell? He's a fairy. He just looks like a fairy. Why did they not put more postcards in the album? Oh my gosh, they have all these photos they're sitting on. Ugh. Man, I love this. Okay, so every set comes with eight postcards. So, that was the beautiful set. And the brilliant set. Hey, this one's right side up. The Starship logo's on the bag. One day, I'm gonna film a video and nothing will be upside down. But that day is not anywhere close. I really love the brilliant one so much. Just, uh. And then the back. This is such a pretty color, what the hell? I think I'm gonna put these in my binder just so they're easier to look at, but. Oh, man. Why does he look at us like that? It's just rude. Why does he look at us like that? Oh my gosh. This is the rudest set of postcards I have ever looked at. so happy right now. Oh my gosh. This is the rudest one. Oh my god. Just, ugh. Okay. Man, there's only one more. Oh gosh, I like these. I'm so happy I bought these. Ugh. And last but not least is the beside version. This one's also right side up. The side version was my second favorite one, so I have a lot of, uh, what's 
the word? Expectations? That's not the word. Just, I have a feeling this one's gonna be good. Of course, they've all been good, but this one especially. I just love these unit shots so much. Can't get it, there we go. These postcard sets are still in stock on the official website, so if you want them, you shouldn't have any trouble getting them. Why is this one solo? Like, Juhan is kind of in the corner, but, like, not really. I don't mind, though. More pictures of my bias makes me happy. This one's adorable, though. Oh my god. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. So, those were the official postcard sets. I'm gonna lay everything out, except the posters are gonna be in their tube, because I ain't got the space for that. And then this will be over! Alright, here all of it is. It doesn't look like that much, but Japanese goods were expensive, man. But, um, yeah, like I said, I ordered these through a group order, and I highly, highly recommend the girl I ordered them for, or through, for, ugh, English. But, um, like I said before, I'm pretty sure she only does U.S. group orders, so if you are in the U.S. and you want to order some Monstox merchandise, I will leave her info down below, so y'all can order from her, because I, like I said, she's great. But, yeah, I don't have a whole lot to say about these things, except that I'm really happy to have them. And y'all should definitely get yourself some of those postcards, because God bless. But, um, I hope you guys like this, and thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.